Hello my dears, today our lesson about the place and the value. Let's start our lesson. We have here numbers house. It has three rooms. First room is called one's room. One's room. Which is the smallest room? What does that mean? It means it takes only one digit number. Second room here is the tens room. Tens room. If we have two digits number, we put them in ones and in tens. Next room here is called hundred room. Hundred room. If we have three digits number, we put them in three rooms. Let's see. This is Mr. One. Hello, Mr. One. Do you want to enter the house? Yes, I want. In which room will you sit? I will take one's room because I am only one digit. So, number one will enter or live in one's room. Because number one, it has only one digit number. So, the place of number one, it means the room or the room of the number which it entered. Now we have number two. It will sit in which room? Hmm, in one's room. Then, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now, what is the number after nine? Hmm? So here I ask myself. How many digits are in 10? Hmm, two digits. So it needs two rooms. One's room and ten's room. We put 20, zero in ones and two in tens. Then, then 30, zero in ones place and three in tens place. 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Now, what's the number after 90? Hmm. 100. So I ask myself how many digits are in 100? Three digits. So it needs three rooms. One's room, tenth room, hundred room. Look here. First zero live in one's room. Second zero live in tenth room. Third number here, number one, live in hundred room. Move to the value. What's meant by value? Value of any number depends on its place. How? We have here that number 83. First, I will get the places first of each number. Once tens. I ask myself, three in which place? In ones or tens? Hmm. In ones. Eight in which place? In tens place. Now I want to go to get out the value of each number. Here, 3 in 1's place. So its value will be equals 3. 8 in 10's place. It means, do you remember when we said before, 1 in 10's equal 10. 2 10's equal 20. 3 10's equal 30. So 8 in 10's equals Hmm, 80, so its value will be 80. Here number 1, 
number 12 first we will find the place of each number so we put our places one stint one stint so i ask myself one in which place i will put one in which place in tenth place two in which place in one's place now i want to get the value of each number here so two in ones its value equals equals two okay one in tens its value equals hmm, do you remember when we say one ten equals ten and two tens equals twenty three tens equals thirty so here one tens equals its value will be ten so we say that value of any number depends on its place so in tens we put just one zero in ones no zero let's look here again so two in ones it's a value two one in tens we put here one zero so it's a value become ten okay let's answer that example to be easy for you we have here number 86 first i put my places once tens now i ask myself Six in ones, its value will be huh, in ones, no zeros. So, six its value, six. So, eight tens. Hmm. In tens, we put a zero. So, its value will be eighty. So, next example here, we have that number nineteen. Okay, first I put my places once tens now i want to know the value of nine in ones in ones no zero so its value will be nine okay one tens in tens we put a zero so its value will be equals ten let's answer that example here complete we have that number 46 so first thing we do we put our places once tens in letter a he asked about the place of number four number four here it's whom it's or it's room is tens and its value equals hmm, in tens we put just one zero so its value equals 40. in letter b he asked about the place of number six here Six live in which place in ones and its value so we say before in in once place we don't put any zero so its value equals six write the place of the digit five in the following numbers okay we put our places first one stands look here we have number five only so number five in once place there is no tens here then we have 65 50 okay here in first number 53 here number five in which place in ones or tens hmm. look here in ones or tens in tens place okay we have here just five so five in which place in ones we have here 65 so five here in which place look in ones we have here number 50 so five here in which place in tens okay write the place of the digit nine in the following numbers so we put our places first we have here 39 90 and the nine so we have here ones only and 97 okay let's look here we have 39 9 here in which place look in ones 90 so 9 here in which place hmm. in tens we have here just 9 so 9 here in ones 97 so 9 here in which place look in tens okay let's answer that example here 
circle the value of the blue digits circle the value the value of blue okay first number i have here 83 so which number is blue 8 okay now i ask myself 8 in which place in tens so i ask now about the value 8 in tens hmm. remember we say in tens we put a zero so its value will be equals hmm, which 8 or 80 80 next i have here 45 so the bl the blue digit is 5 so now i ask myself 5 in which place in once place so we say before in once no zero so the value equals 5 okay next we have here number 17 look at the blue digit so the blue digit here is 1 so now I ask myself 1 in which place in tens so 1 in tens its value equals in tens put a 0 so its value equals 10 62 which is a blue digit 2 okay I ask myself 2 in which place in one's place so its value equals hmm, in one's no zero so its value equals 2 next 37 so 3 in tens so in tens I put 0 to get the value so the value will be equals 30 the last here I have number 94 4 in one's place so in one's no zero so its value equals 4 let's remember together we have here one stick we say before one stick equals 10 or we can say 1 10 okay look here we have one small square equals 1 or we can say once so 10 ones equal 1 10 again 10 ones equals 1 10 one stick let's complete together we have here 35 okay I ask myself number 3 in which place hmm. in which room in tens so I have here three in tens so I have three stacks okay five five in which place in ones so I have we say before we represent ones by small squares so five in ones so we have five small squares next we have here number 40 we get our place so 4 in which place in tens place so we have here 4 stacks 0 in which place in ones there is no small squares because 0 and ones ok let's answer that example count the blocks in each set and circle the number ok here in first one we say before in tens represent it by one stick and ones by small squares ok so in tens I have one stick in ones how many small squares one two three four so four in ones and one in tens so the number will be fourteen two in tens and three in ones so the number will be twenty three one two three three in tens and six in ones so the number will be thirty six next I have here one two three three stacks so three in tens and three in ones so the number will be thirty three okay I have here two stacks in tens and six small squares in ones so the number will be twenty six
I have here 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 in tens. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 in ones. So the number will be 48. I have here just one stick in tens and three small squares in ones. So the number will be 13. I have here one stick in tens. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine small squares in ones. So the number will be nineteen. I have here one, two, three in tens and four small squares in ones. So four in ones, three in tens. So the number will be thirty-four. Okay, let's complete here. First number we have 43. First thing we do, we put our places. One tens. So three in one place, four in ten place. Okay? Okay, he asked me here in tens. Which number here I will put in tens? Hmm. Look here. Three in tens? No, four in tens. Okay. Equals what? I want to get the value of 4 tenths. So we say before in tenths we put a 0. So its value equals 40. Okay. Here. Ask me in ones. I will put what? 4? No. 3. So its value. We say before there is no 0 in ones. So it equals three okay we have your number 70 he asked me intense place which number intense place I will put seven and its value equals we say before intense we put a zero so its value equals 70 here in ones which number I will put zero and its value equals zero the last one here we have 29 we put our places one tens. so he asked me here which number in tens place hmm, two and its value equals let's remember again we say in tens we put a zero so its value equals 20 here in ones i will put nine and its value equals no zero in once no zero in one so its value equals nine write the value of each digit the value he asked about the value okay first number here 56 so first thing i do i put the places once tens once tens okay the value of five in tens 5 in tens. So in tens we put a 0. Its value equals 50. 6 in ones. In ones no 0. So its value equals 6. Okay. Next we have here 65. 65. We put places first. Ones, tens. Ones, tens. Okay. We have here 6 in tens. So in tens we put a 0 to get the value. So its value equals 60. 5 in ones. In ones, no zero to get the value. So its value equals 5. Now we need to know what's meaning by expanded form. Expanded form is adding the numbers with its value. Adding the numbers with its value. Tens or ones. Let's see answer that example to know what's meaning by expanded form okay first number we have here 32 first thing we do we put our places once tens so now in once a place I have two I will get the value of two and put it here so the value of number two equals two in ones there is no zero in one so its value will be equals hmm, two ok 
Okay, three in tens. So I get the value, the value of three in tens. Huh? In tens, we put a zero, so its value equals thirty. That is the form of expanded form. Okay. Next, we have here number fifty-six. So we put our places once tens. Hmm. I will get the value of number six and put it here. So six in ones, no zeros in ones. So its value equals six. Five in tens. In tens, we put a zero to get the value. So its value equals fifths. Here, number eighty, we put our places once tens. So in ones, we have a zero. So we put here zero. Eight in tens. In tens, we put a zero. So its value will be equals eighty. Write the expanded form of the numbers. Okay, first number I have here sixty-seven. So we put our places once tens. Seven in ones. Its value equals seven. Six in tens. Its value equals in tens. We put a zero. So its value will be sixty. Next, eighty-nine. We put our places once tens. Nine in ones. Its value equals. Hmm, I get the value and put it here. Equals nine. Okay. Eight in tens. Its value equals eighty. Now, he want to know the number that it will be ten plus two. Hmm. I want to back forward. So, both places as we do first. One tens. Then, ten plus two equals what? Hmm. 12 Easy Next I ask here about the number That equals 60 plus 5 So Both places once tens So Here 5 in, in which place In once So I will pack 5 again to its room 60 60 It means hmm, Back forward, six in tens. Or I can say sixty plus five equals what? Sixty five. It is the same. We have here one, two, three, four. Four in tens plus one, two, three. Three ones. So four tens. That means it equals. Huh, forty plus three in ones. Huh, in ones no zero. So equals three. So forty plus three equals. Hmm. Let's count after forty. Forty one. Forty two. Forty three. Right. How many tens and ones? Let's see. Here in tens, let's count how many sticks we have. One, two, three. So we have here three sticks. So we put here in tens three. In ones, I have just one small square. So I will put here one. Okay, three in tens. That mean equals huh, three tens equals thirty. 1 in 1s equals 1. So 30 plus 1 equals 31. Next. I have here 1 stack. So in 10s I will put 1. In 1s I have 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 in 1s. So 1 tens equals. Hmm, in 10s I put 1 0. So its value equals 10. In ones, no zero, so its value equals here four. So ten plus four equals hmm, fourteen. Let's answer our math booklet page thirty-one. The place. What is the place? Is the home of a number tens or ones? What is the value? Value depends on its place. In ones, no zero. In tens, put a zero. Okay. The place of number 7 in 97. He asked about the place. Hmm. Here, 7. In which place? In ones. The value of 7 in 97. 
7 in 1 so its value will be 7 because no 0 in 1 ok next the place of number 2 in 25 look here 2 in which place in 10th place the value of 2 in 25 he asked about the value 2 in 10th so its value equals 20 because we put a 0 not 110 equals 10 ones. Page 32 complete as example. We have here that number 28. The value of 2 is 2 in tens. So its value 20. Next, the place of 2 is, mm, we say, in tens. The value of 8 is 8 in ones. So its value will be 8. The place of 8 is 1's Ok, next one We have here 36 He ask about the value of 3 The value of 3 here hmm, 30 The place of 3 3 in 10's The value of 6 hmm, 6 Because the place of 6 is 1's Ok, we have here 69 The value of 6 is Hmm. 60 The place of 6 is 10th The value of 9 9 in 1 So its value is 9 Because no 0 in 1 The place of 9 is huh, 1 The last one We have that number 10 He asks me about the value of 1 1 in 10 So its value will be hmm, in tens put a zero equals ten. So the place of one is tens. Okay? The value of zero hmm, zero here zero. So the place of the of zero is ones. We have here in math booklet page thirty three complete. First example here. We have number 53. He asked about tens and ones. So here tens is 5 and ones is 3. I guess we have here 78. So I want to get tens and ones. So 78. In tens place we have hmm, 7. In ones place we have here 8. Next. 45 so hmm, which number here in tense place 4 hmm, in ones we have 5 next we have here 29 so in tens which number 2 in ones 9 next we have here number 70 we wanted to get tens and ones so in tens we will put seven in ones zero. Next we have here is seen in tens. Which number eight or one? One. Eight in ones. Next we have here thirty six in tens place. We will put three in ones six. Next we have here eighty two. So in tens we will put eight. In ones we will we will put two. Next, as we do, we have here number sixty one. So in tens we will put six. In ones we will put one. The last one here we have number fifty seven. He asked about the tens. Which number five? And ones is seven. Which number thirty four? Write the value. We ask about the value. Remember again, we say in ones no zero. In tens we have a zero. Okay, let's see the example. We have here number 54. Five, look here, five in tens place. So we put a zero. So its value will be 50. We have here 47. Seven here in ones place. So its value will be 7, no 0 in 1's. 
we have here number 83 so 8 here in tenth place so it's a value equals 8 okay let's answer that we have here number 35 5 here in ones so it's a value equals hmm, 5 okay next we have here 89 8 here in tens so its a value will be 80 we have here number 33 here 3 in ones a place so its a value equals 3 next we have here 74 okay 7 here in tens a place so its a value equals 70 because in tens we put a zero Next, we have here 25, 2 in tens place, so its value equals 20, 44, 4, that 4 in ones place, so its value equals 4. Next, we have here 51, here 1 in ones place, so its value equals 1. We have here number 37, 3 here in tens place, so its value equals 30 we have here 62 6 here in tens place so we say before in tens we put a zero so it's a value equals 60 here we have number 55 so 5 here in tens it's a value equals 50 42 2 here in ones so it's a value equals 2 next we have 18 1 here in tens place so it's a value equals 10 39 3 here in tens place so its value equals hmm, 30 we have here 16 6 here in ones a place so its value equals 6 we have here 38 so 8 here in ones a place so its value equals 8 we have here number 40 4 here in tens place so its value equals 40 because in tens we put a 0 we have here number 89 so here 9 in ones place its value equals 9 next we have here 99 9 here in tens place so its value equals 9 90 we have here 70 0 here in ones place so its value equals 0 we have here 28, 2 here in tens place, so its value equals 20. We have here 48, so 4 here in tens place, so its value equals 40. Next, page 35. Okay, he asked here to choose the following. First one, he asked the value of 7 in 71 so here 7 in tens place so it's a value equal 70 next he ask about the place of 9 in 89 huh. 9 here leave in which room in which place in ones the value he ask about the value of 4 in 14 4 here in once a place so its a value equals 4 because in once a place no 0 okay next he ask about the place of 0 in 30 he ask about place about the home of number 0 here hmm. 0 here live in which place in once next the value of 0 in 30 he asked now about value hmm. 0 the place of 2 in 23 he asked about the home of number 2 in 23 hmm. 2 here live in which place in tens place the value of 8 in 80 in the number what hmm. 82 he asked about the value of 8 in 80. 80. In which one? Look here, 8 in 1s. So it's a value 8. And here, 8 in 1s. So it's a value equals 8. Here, but here, 8 in 10s. So it's a value equals 
80. Next, page 36. Write the place. Now, he asks about the place of the underlying digit. Ask about the place, so he asks about the home, ones or tens. So, in letter A, he make underline under number 5. So, here, number 5, leave in which home? In tens home. Okay, number B, we have number 73. So, here, 3, leave in which home? In ones home. Letter C, we have here 22. He asked about the first two here. So, that two live in which place? In tens. In letter D, we have here 96. He asked about nine. In which place? In tens. In letter E, he asked about 18. So, he underlined the number eight. So, eight here live in which place? In ones. Letter F. 45. He asked about 5. Huh. In which place? In ones. Letter G. 72. He underlined number 7. So 7 leave in which place? In tens. Letter H. Underline number 8. Leave in which place? Hmm. In tens. In letter I, we have here number 36. He underlined number 6. In which place? In ones. Then next, we have here 91. He asked about 1. In which place? In ones. Next, we have here 84. He underlined number 8. In which place? In tens. Next, we have here 70. 9. In which place does 9 live? Hmm. Its room is once. Then next we have here 28. In which place 2 live in tens? We have here 53. Hmm. He asked about number 5. 5 here live in which place? In tens place. Next. Write the digits in the correct place to form a number. Let's see the example. We have here five tens, four ones. So we have five in tens, look, and four in ones. So the number will be 54. Okay, we put our places to be answered. Eight ones, six tens. So we have six and tens and eight and ones so the number will be 68 next we have nine tens three ones so the number will be mm -hmm. 93 next we put our places then we have here seven tens seven ones so the number will be 77 next we put our places we have here five ones and one ten. One ten. So the number will be fifteen. We put our places. We have here six ones and and three tens. So the number will be thirty six. Next. We have here two tens, five ones, two tens. So the number will be twenty. Five. Next, we have here four tens, eight ones. So the number will be forty-eight. Okay, complete. We have here a table. We have a, a numbers, and we have to get tens and ones and expanded for. Let's see first one to know what we are going to do. Okay, first number I have is. 19. I wanted to know in tens place I will put what and in ones place I will put what. So here 19 in tens place which is play which is number 9 or 1? One? 1 in ones 9. Okay to put them in expanded form we wanted to know the value of 9 in 1's the value of 9 in 1's is 
9 the value of 1 in 10 is 10 so 10 plus 9 equals 19 okay we have here number 13 I ask myself in tens which number 1 or 3 1 in 1's 3 okay I wanted to get the value of 3 in 1's it will be I put here it will be 3 1 tens equals 10 so 10 plus 3 equals what I put the big number in my mind small number on my fingers and I will count after 10 11 12 13 okay next I have your number 16 so in tens I will put here which number 1 in 1's 6 okay to get the expanded form we wanted to know the value of 6 in 1's it will be 6 1 tens its value equals 10 so 10 plus 6 equals 16 I have here number 11 okay so in tens I will write 1 in 1's 1 okay the value of 1 in 1's it will be 1 and the value of 1 in tens it will be 10 so 10 plus 1 equals 11 next I have here number 14 in tens I will put 1 in 1's I will put 4 and the expanded form equals what 10 plus 4 so 10 plus 4 equals hmm, count after 10 11 12 13 14 the last one here I have number 15 so in tens I will write 1 in 1 5 the expanded form equals 10 plus 5 so 10 plus 5 equals 15 Write the expanded form of the numbers blue. Okay, first number we have here 23. So 3 in 1s, 2 in 10s. So the value of number 3 will be equals 3. The value of number 2 in 10s equals 20. Next, we have here number 17. So we put our places to be easy to answer. 1s, 10s. So we have here 7 in 1s. So its value will be equals 7 1 in 10 its value equals 10 next we have here 96 we put our places we have here 6 in 1 so its value equals 6 because no 0 in 1's place 9 in 10 in 10 we put a 0 to get the value so the value will be here 90 next we have here 74 we put our places 1 10 Okay, we have here 4 in 1, so its value will be equals 4. 7 in 10, so its value will be equals 70. We have here 31, we put our places, we have 1 in 1, so its value will be equals 1. 3 in 10, so its value will be equals 30. We have here 55, we put our places. We have 5 in 1's, so its value will be 5. 5 in 10's, so its value will be 50, because we put a 0 in a 10's place. Next, we have 89, we put our places, then the value of number 9 in 1's place equals 9. The value of number 8 in 10's place will be 8. Next, we have here number 42, we put our places. Then I ask myself, 2 in 1's place, its value equals 2, 4 in 10's place, so its value will be equals 40, because we put a 0 in 10's place to get the value. Next, we have here 68, we put places, 1's 10's, 8 in 1's, so its value equals 8, 6 in 10's, so its value equals 60. The last one here we have 26 we put our places we have 6 in 1's place so its value will be 6 2 in 10's place so its value will be 20 next here we say fill in the numbers to complete each addition sentence so he ask about the number we will, we will put here equals 10 plus 2 
So we put the places first, one stands. Then we have two ways. First way, we make addition 10 plus 2. 10 plus 2 equals, let's count after 10, 11, 12. So we can put 12. Okay, if we pack forward, look, 2 in ones. So it will be 2. 10, we have here 10. We can put it 1 in tens. Okay, let's see the next one. We have here 40 plus 8. We have two ways. First way, we can make addition 40 plus 2. So we count after 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48. Or what? Look, we have here 8 in ones. So we put here 8 in ones. 40. 40. If we cancel the 0, it will be 4 in tens. You can choose the best way you like it. Okay? We have here 90 plus 1. So the number will be 91 if we make addition. We have here 50 plus 6. 6. If we make addition, will be 56. Look, the another way. We have here 6 in 1. So we put here 6. We have here 50. If we back it forward, we cancel 0 and put 10. So it will be 5 in 10. Okay, we have here 1 stance place. We have here 20 plus 4. If we make addition, it will be 24. Next, we have here 70 plus 3. So if we make addition, it will be 73. If you want to back forward, look. We have here 3 in one place. We put here 3. And we have here 70. If we cancel that 0, because in tens we put 0 to get the value, it will be 7 in tens. Next, we have here 30 plus 7. So, so if we make addition, it will be 37. The last one, we have here 60 plus 9. If we make, make addition, it will be 69. Thank you, my dears.